Hi guys, welcome, welcome back. So today we're gonna do a little bit of just like I have a few videos to prep for, so I thought why not turn the camera on, vlog it, kind of see how today is gonna go and what we're gonna get into and see what we can get, right? Don't record it and who knows, it might be something good. So what I'm getting prepped for right now is a rhinestone organization video. So for all rhinestones, charms, stuff like that. I have a couple different systems and I also have a couple different ideas that I think could work not like using those systems. So I'm just kind of prepping for that right here. I brought out a good majority of my rhinestones because I do want to kind of go in depth and kind of show them a little bit just of some organization but with that being said I also want to show different ways that you could use stuff not using those micro containers right so I know that you could do um, smaller pots in the Dollar Tree things that I have some glitter and extra um, sequences and stuff like that could work I wanted to show this little thing because this is also one option Mine came broke, so that's not a good option, but I got it from Allie and I didn't even realize that it was sitting there for a while, unfortunately. But I think I have a good way that I could organize that and then just look in there. I gotta see if they're glass though, that's actually, I usually don't order stuff that's not at least glass, but I don't remember now. So I do wanna make sure that I look that up um, we have some nail designs that we have to do today. Uh, we have to do for the game. Um, design it. I have to do that today because today is already Thursday and I haven't even started that. I kind of have an idea of what I'm going to do. The theme's baby shower, so we have to stay in that realm, but I kind of have an idea of something that I'm going to do. Oh my, that was so long ago that I ordered this thing. Watch. It's going to be so hard to find it. I hate that. Sometimes finding stuff on Alley can be a pain in the butt. I just have to go back so far. I wonder if I add it all up to how much money I spent on AliExpress. Oof, I don't want to know that though. In all truth, your girl does not want to know that. So the time right now is 10.30. Um, I got up pretty early this morning for me and my standards. I usually don't get up until around 10, to be honest. 10, 10.30 is when I like to be like catching myself and getting out of bed um, and that usually I usually stay in bed for about 20 minutes half hour try to catch up on, e on anything that I can so usually around 10 30 I get out of bed um, but today I was up at 8 o'clock showered got ready um, had a banana for breakfast and that's it in the studio because I have so much to do today. So I ideally need to do three designs, two just no two designs. This video, I'm gonna vlog also today. This the rhinestone video is gonna take a little bit. Flap back. Oh, they are glass. Okay, so they are glass. Unfortunately though, my thing came broken and a watch. Yeah. My dispute time's over, but it's fine. I think I can still use the little things and show them. But I do want to grab, so I'm going to come with you. We're going to grab a few different organized things that we can use. So I'm going to flip you guys because there's a lot of different things that we can use that... Oh, wow, you're all up in my business. So let me just flip you. This thing's still like, still red. It's still a little cracked. I don't know, either not putting the stuff on enough or I just... Hell truth, I take a while to heal though. I don't know why my body's like that. So I want to use this as an example. That's a good one. Okay, so these are good examples of different stuff. So I want to grab them out. This is a good example not the best example and I think I'm gonna take that out of there anyways and not store that there 
these I want to show. I don't normally keep my stuff in that, but I want to show it because a lot of people use these. So, and then again, I have, we have a lot of something that can work. I think we have a female one. I think that's pretty okay. And like these. Oh my god, my desk is gonna be so full because there's so many different ways to organize stuff. So I'm gonna have to figure how I'm going to. I'm gonna show this too because I think it's important. I have stuff like this that is big. I mix them. And the reason I do that is because that is so easy to grab out. I don't need to individually do these. I think that's perfectly fine. It's fun to look at. You can get different ideas. The same with the little bears. There's so many of them. I'm fine mixing them all. They do not need to be individual. That's getting too tedious for me in my life. So, yeah, I think that's fine because those are just basics. You don't have to mix pearls but I think that's fine these I'm gonna put up here though I think because I have some I have this system up here as well and usually I would just put all of them in there like that And that's fine. And then again, a couple little extra things. These could just stay in there. My seashells, they work for that pebbles. So I think that can work. Be like, sorry, this is going to be a very in-depth video and it's going to be probably long, but it's going to cover all your bases of how to store, what you could use to store, and what works. Drawer system or you make your own system for stackables, which could work too. So, I think we are okay. I think I have one extra container that I can bring out to show as well. Okay, I love you guys. I will be back after I film this video. Um... Wish me luck. I might come back like, I'm dead. <laughs> it was so much. Um, or I may come back and be like, wow, that's awesome. That was a great video. Probably more like that because my energy is really pumped in this video and I get to go through a lot of my crystals and stuff like that a little bit more in depth, which I love. So it's, it gives me life to do that. So, but I love you guys and I'll see you soon. I just got finished filming the rhinestone organization video and I really thought there were some really good points of what and how and everything you can use and just there's a lot go definitely check it out i really recommend it if you've ever been having trouble organizing your rhinestones or charms i hope that that will give you some sort of clarity and just kind of figure it out what can work for you there's a lot of good stuff in there and that's it so we're just going to kind of put everything back away we had to take it all out but now i have to reorganize my stuff and then we're going to go on. I do want to show you just quickly. This vlog is the weirdest vlog ever. I know, guys. But I wanted to show you quickly how I put my practice hand together to get it prepared to do a nail art design on it. Whether it be tips or whether it be a full cover nail. So I'm going to pop that in here as well. Like I said, this is an odd one. But I'm just going to keep it the way it is. You know what? Let's be all over the place. Sometimes that's just how our day goes. And this literally was how my day went. So you just kind of came along with me. Okay, so I'm just going to get my Elena hand um, all ready. I'm going to do some nail designs. 
I have to do at least, yeah, I have to do that one at least, I think, today. So we are going to use her. She cute. Now tips that I use for her. I usually just get tips. Like if I, honestly, last time I grabbed the wrong ones. Not even a big deal. I just put it in while well, I fit it. That's a little too small. So this is just a regular tip. And I'm just using this for the nail bed anyways. I'm going to flip it around though. Maybe only get one. It is a straight square. So you're not going to want to see curve. You're not going to want nothing like that. So I just stick it behind. Push it as far as she'll go. I'm just going to do that with all of them first. And these are going to be, that is how her hands look or her hand looks right now. You can take your knickers, you can take scissors, you can take whatever you want. Just get in there and cut that off. And then, that's why in all truth, I kind of prefer to use scissors, but get these little guys off. And then you can just kind of take that off or just go in and file it down even. being tight today I need to use a Russian almond a long Russian almond so I'm just gonna kind of fit her kind of big perfect so I'm just gonna line up these nails here quite quick and then I'll just show you guys I don't know if I've ever showed how I put my fingers on so you want to get your light to where you're gonna want it grab your tip now you could buff guys this is on yourself buff yes but because Susie is not going to be wearing these nails if you know what I mean you don't really gotta be like too crazy trying not to be in your way so we're just putting a little bit of glue not a lot we don't want to oversaturate and we don't need a lot right So on and so forth guys and the reason I like to actually attach a tip to the nail and go into the well is because when you're filing and you're practicing your nails like even if you're just practicing nail art and you or you're shaping even like if you're not putting a tip on it to actually build up the nail I 
like to put that back there because you're getting all that as your support in your hand and this will go well, this works with the same thing with any hand the, this is a elena hand but um any hand that you can stick that back there just make nail beds it makes it easier i feel no truth Now I am going to put it in the lamp because I want to make sure that all of my glue is nice and dried. So I'm just going to, for her, I just lower her hand. And I literally put my light over top of her. She's good. And that is it. That's how I put nails on a practice hand. So any tip, as I said, if you have regular tips, just use straight square. Straight square is your best bet for your nail bed. Um, can be a tip. It doesn't have to be a full cover or anything like that. So yeah, works good for me. Um, I would say extra long, definitely, because you want it to reach back, right? You want to make sure it reaches back there. So don't go too short because the whole point is to give that security. So guys, I'm just going to sign off on the vlog for now. Who knows this might be a short one we'll think i don't know if we'll come back on it but i do want to just say i love you guys and bye now in case we don't continue this and if not then you know but i will see you in the next one thank you guys so much for joining hit that subscribe and give it a thumbs up comment down below and heck share it with a friend all right guys bye